I'm here today to deliver the eulogy for Elizabeth Jenna Saltzman. Do you think I'm broken? She was an easy target who couldn't control her brain chemistry. <laughs> so it was easier to think that she was broken. I'm the broken one. I have just been seeing things and hearing things and feeling things that no one else does. And it's scary. Then to root for her and accept that she was changing. I'm doing everything that I can to get better. Really better. Lizzie was more than one thing. She was a kind soul. <laughs> I can't live like this anymore. Allow me to turn you into a vampire. I can't make this decision until I'm sure. Why drink vampire blood? Please don't let me die. It's time to start remembering. That isn't exactly what the green flashlight would do. First of all, it's Green Lantern, and you know it. Just like you know way too many Hobbit insults to not be a secret Tolkien fan. I volunteer as tribute. Would you like to be the Robin to my Batwoman? I'll just ask him about Star Wars or something, and then we'll talk the whole time. You're the hero. I'm not a hero, Dad. But I'm not a hero either. This is nerd porn, not real life. If you tell anyone that I read nerd porn, I will deny it. Can I get you anything? You're not scared of Josie hurting you. You're scared of hurting her. And then you lost control. I killed her. I just don't want to make the same mistake again. So let's dance. But I'm not getting my merge on until I know that the rest of the school is safe. Are you seriously telling me that I'm going to die because I became a better person? Life was so much easier when I only cared about myself. It's so nice to know that you all love me as much as I thought you did. Nobody is upset about me being dead. They all hate me. We'll never get them to say anything nice about Lizzie. Well, it doesn't mean we give up on her. I hate you, Lizzie's. Lizzie, you're alive? I am right on time to kick your ass. <laughs> She deserves to be with someone who sees her for who she is. At some point, you might actually have to apologize. <sighs> Never apologize. I wish I could tell her how sorry I am for not seeing it. For being so wrapped up in myself that I didn't even notice she was struggling. 